Hello, my name is Evan Rogers. Welcome to Evan's Easy English Listening Practice. Today, I'm here to tell you about the widely used dishwasher. In Japan, dishwashers are not very common. However, in the US, almost every home has one. I love my dishwasher. It makes my life much easier. A dishwasher uses hot water and dishwasher detergent to clean your glasses, cups, mugs, plates, bowls, spoons, knives, etc. You can see my dirty dishes on the counter. Notice the spaghetti sauce. Ew! Tomato sauce is a very hard stain to clean. We'll briefly hand wash each of the dishes. Notice I'm only using one hand. You don't need to hand wash much when you use a dishwasher. I'm only using my fingers on a few of them. Some of these dishes look like they're already clean, but they had clear liquids on them. The square bowls had salad dressing in them. Salad dressing has a strong scent. Ew! Look at that spatula! It's orange because of the spaghetti sauce. Even after washing it well, it still has some orange spots on it. The large plastic container too. Even after I wash it, it still has some orange stains. It also smells a lot like spaghetti sauce. These bowls still have some dried spaghetti sauce on them when I put them in the dishwasher. I put the ceramic dishes and the metal utensils on the bottom. The bottom rack will be the hottest area of the dishwasher. Ceramics and metals won't break from heat so they go on the bottom rack. I put the glass and plastic items on the top rack. These items are weaker and more likely to break from heat than the ceramic dishes on the bottom. Make sure that the openings of the everything are pointing down. If the openings are pointed up, they'll fill with water the dishes will move a little bit when washing. It's best to keep the dishes from touching one another. Because the large plastic container is so large, it has to go on the bottom rack. This is okay. It shouldn't be a problem. Here's how to use your dishwasher. On the right is my detergent. Cascade is a popular brand in the US. On the left is a finisher, which prevents white drying stains from appearing on the dishes. Put a little bit of detergent in the pre-wash area 
and a little bit in the main wash area. Unscrew the screw and put the finisher inside. You don't need to put finisher in every wash. Only a little bit is used each wash. Close your dishwasher all the way. It's best to use the heat dry setting so that everything dries. Turn the notch to normal or whatever you prefer, and you're done! Look! All the dishes are spotless! The plates have no spaghetti sauce, neither do the bowls. The spatula looks white, not orange, and the big plastic container doesn't smell at all like spaghetti sauce.